Hey folks, welcome to the channel. We are here at CES, it's Consumer Electronics Show 2025 in Las Vegas. Now, something that I've seen a lot here this year at the show has been things to clean your house. Now, in previous years, I've seen a lot of vacuums, but now we've moved past vacuums to floor mops, vacuums that can jump up on top of things, vacuums with robotic arms, things that can clean your pool, things that can clean windows, and even things that can robotically clean your solar panels. So let's check out a couple of things that I found out a few of the manufacturers here at CES that do just that. Welcome to CES 2025. My name is Kite Sandke. I'm communications lead, and this is Roborock. So I was asked to see what's the wildest stuff here, and I'm looking down, I already see it. It's an arm. So for God's sake, why does Roborock have an arm? Well. You want to have a clean house and there's a lot of obstacles around, so what do you do? Well, you, you always clean around. Okay. Normally, we would clean very, very tightly around, but that means below this, it's always dirty. That's why we got the arm. It lifts up a sock, it lifts up towels, it lifts up slippers and cleans below. But that's not all. Of course, the, the sock's still there. So what do we do? You tell in the app where you want the socks go to. So the socks go in the bathroom, the slippers go to the front door, the towels to the bathroom as well, and then it's clean and tidy. Well, what else do we have? It's not about the arm actually, there's more. We got a new sensor array because you don't see any tower here. There's the lighter, the lighter's gone because we're now using 3D time of flight. Complicated word in very simple explanation, it's just a sensor array scattered around, a lot of dots shooting in your room and seeing three-dimensionally what's happening. So it sees a couch, it sees a table, it can also recognize the room, which means, very intelligently, we first clean the living room, we then clean the kitchen, we clean the mops itself, we go back, we clean the bathroom, lift up the mops, touch anything, clean again, so we're always tidy. What else do we got? Well, it's not only in the front, it's all on the side and in the back, that means we're always connected we're always knowing where we are we have a very good navigational array here well I should come back to the arm because I missed some things a here right next to the grip there's a camera as well so we don't have, not only have a camera in the front we not only have a camera here on the arm we also have a camera in the back what do they do this one obstacle recognition sees where the sock is this one sees, okay, I can extend the arm because maybe I'm below a, fur uh, a furniture or something. And this one then finally sees where the arm goes and grips it. And you know what the real fun and cool stuff is because we're all actually nerds. I can use the app and control it myself. So there's the remote. Where is it always? It's always next to the TV. It's never where it should be. So we just go with the robot. We control it. We lift up the remote and bring it back. And that's only possible because we're now overriding the safety control. So, that's a cool thing, we got still more products, also one without the arm, but that is actually the wildest thing from Roborock at CES 2025. Hi, my name is TC Ching, I'm a marketing manager here at Ecovex. Welcome to CES 2025. I'm going to walk you through the booth here and talk about some of the new products and innovations that we're bringing to the market. So the first one is with our robot vacuum called the X8 Pro Omni. And Ecovex was the first to bring vacuum and mop to the category and what we've done here is we're introducing now the roller mop and you can see here the roller mop and what it does is it's uh, it automatically self cleans itself as it's cleaning so it's instantly self washing as you're as you're mopping um, so with every roll there's a dirty and clean water tank in the robot and it's squeezing all the dirty water into the dirty tank and refreshing the pad with fresh water you also see here that it extends and the side mop extends it well and it knows how far to extend with this 3D sensor on the side here. It's commonly used 3D sensors on the front to avoid obstacles. We've now added one to the side so that it can go as close as possible to edges and corners. What's also new with this is the cleaning station. It's a brand new design here. It's got the clean and dirty water tanks. So the robot will come back here and it'll get washed. Uh, the pads will get washed, dried and refilled with fresh water. We can add cleaning solution, concentrate here, and it'll automatically get diluted with the fresh water. So this is the X8 Pro Omni. It'll be available in February for $12.99. Okay. We can go over a couple of the other new products here. We've got the T50 Max Pro. The big difference here is that it has the spinning mops instead of the roller mop. It also has a brand new motor design and fan design. So for uh, optimal airflow, 
and the most uh, suction power of, of the category. Okay, great. Let's move on to the other products. Really excited to introduce a new lineup of robotic lawnmowers. The first one I want to talk about is the A1-3000 LiDAR. So this brings LiDAR technology to the category and you can see there there's a LiDAR module on the, on the top there. So it's a, it actually has three technologies to help navigate and map and avoid obstacles. The first one is the top mounted LiDAR. The next one you'll see is the LiDAR in the front and then also the front facing camera that's used for uh, obstacle avoidance. To round out the lineup, there's the A2500 RTK and the O1000 RTK. These also have three technologies used to navigate and map, but it's using RTK technology, which is a satellite technology. It's referencing up to 40 satellites to get accurate positioning um, so that it always knows where it is up to uh, inch accuracy. Uh, one more note on this one is the uh, cutting efficiency. I wanted to touch on that. There's a couple of factors that lead to the uh, greater cutting efficiency. One is the dual cutting paths, cutting blades, and I can show that here. It has the dual plates um, with this and the faster cutting speed and the faster charging. It's able to cut uh, much more efficiently and quicker. And so this is the W2 Pro Omni robotic window cleaner. So very convenient to help you clean both inside and outside of the home. This one has a portable docking station and portable battery pack, which is really convenient. It allows you to bring this to any window in your house without needing to worry about outlets or having an extension cord. You can just carry that with you to where your windows are. As she's demonstrating here, very easy to attach and detach. You just press it, the button three, two or three seconds, and it attaches to the window with suction power. So this last one is called the Winbot Mini. And as you can see, it's very mini. So it's about eight and a half inches square versus the other model that's about 10 and a half inches square. Light and thin and ideal for small spaces like this, inside or out, under blinds or under security bars. So thanks for coming by and we'll uh, look for these products uh, at your local retailer or online. So today we're gonna start with our new J15 model that we have out on the market and we have an even more advanced version that's coming out in March. So the J15 series is a mopping and regular dry vacuum system in one. So we've got down the bottom here, you've got the spinny pads that can scrub stuff and, um, and it can also at the same time suck up dry debris. The cool thing with this is that when it senses carpet, it, the pads will actually lift up and back into the towards the vacuum um, so that you don't have to worry about getting um, sorry so you don't have to worry about uh, getting carpets wet also one of the things that can be a real issue with vacuums or pain point with vacuums is that hair gets tangled in the brush rolls so what we've done is we've created a system here where it can actively cut hair and pet fur um, while it's cleaning so super easy I love robots because they're a set it and forget it so this guy can also navigate around the house on the top part of the vacuum. You can see this little guy up here. This is the LiDAR navigation system that can go and it can map your home. It can see where things are. It knows where to not to bump into stuff. You can set maps in your phone um, or it'll map your house. And then you can set different cleaning zones. You can schedule it if you want. Um, so it's a really cool system. And we do also have some object detection in it so that it can detect objects like cords and other things to avoid. And we continue to update that regularly so it can go, just when you do a software update, when we've added new things for it to identify, it'll automatically uh, add those to its list to avoid. What's cool about this one too, as I said, it's totally set it and forget it because you have a base station. So for up to 45 days, it can go back, it goes back to its base station after it's been cleaning and recharges, but it'll go back there, it'll dump the dirty water, it'll suck all the debris out. It can actually clean the pads with a scrubbing, um, with the brushes down, or uh, cleans the pads down there. It'll also air dry um, everything so that you don't have to worry about mold or anything like that growing. It has a clean water tank and a dirty water tank in there. Um, and the dry debris also goes in 
a bag system here. So it's at 45 days that you can set it, forget it, let it clean, mop your house. Um, so this guy also does a really good job climbing and it can go up to inch and a half over obstacles. Um, and it has sensors that can figure out where, you know, sense them. It'll move back and it'll assess how it needs to climb up. The back of this one, we've got the, um, these guys can come out to get into the corners. Another thing I like is the shape is actually a squircle is the technical word. And what, what's it called? a squircle, a square and circle okay. together. What's cool is that when it goes into like corners and stuff, it actually can navigate pretty well and it'll go around with these. It can go, knows to go around, you know, like tables, chairs. It can navigate its way in and around obstacles where robots typically get stuck. All right, hi, I'm Nick Phillips, the general manager in the US with APER, and I'm gonna introduce you to some of our newest, most innovative products that we came out with at CES. So we'll start here. This is our Hydrocom Pro. This is our water quality testing system that will manage, monitor your water five different types. You'll get your pH balance, you'll get your temperature and others reported directly to your phone in real time. It's also solar powered, so no need to charge it or unplug it. This also works as our communication system with our Aper Scuba X1 Pro Max, which we'll talk about here in just a second. We'll move over here. This is the Aper Iresense. This is our innovation award winner for this, for this year. Uh, it is our water monitoring system and sprinkler system. Uh, you're able to map your yard, so you'll be able to save 40% water by not watering your concrete or areas that you don't want to. You can also set this to water specific days and times that you want. And you'll also be able to have the sensor, uh, the soil monitoring sensing system, which will tell you when your water actually needs to be done. Now we'll move over here to the Aper Scuba X1 Pro Max, our big advancement this year. All right, this is the Aper Scuba X1 Pro Max. This is the what we proudly call your new poolside hero. Uh, this is an all-in-one pool cleaning. So this not only cleans the floor, but it'll also clean the walls. Has the horizontal water line cleaning capability to clean that stubborn algae and debris off of there. And then it will actually come up to the top of the water and do your skimming. So it gets rid of all your leaves and debris and takes care of all your pool. This has nine motors built in. So it gives us the industry leading 8,500 uh, uh, 8, gallons of suction power. And then also it does the complete all in one gives you three different modes of eco, auto, and max, so you can customize when and how much your pool needs cleaning. Give you up to 10 hours of cleaning and five hours of surface, or 10 hours of surface cleaning and five hours of total cleaning. The Aper Scuba X1 Pro Max also comes with the wireless caddy and wireless power charging. So you'll be able to pull your uh, Aper Scuba X1 Pro Max out of the water, put it on your caddy, and take it to wherever it is that you need to go getting it ready for its next mission to clean your pool. Hello, welcome to the Small Rovers. We have a new uh, model for this year, 2025. This is P10. The, the machine equipped with the laser uh, camera and the sonar. The laser and the camera is used to mapping the shape of your pool. The camera, like human eyes, they have the, like the vision-based AI. They can see exactly well have the dirty stuff like the leaves, debris, and then the machine will go there directly to catch the dirty stuff. Uh, this is our the most powerful model for 2025. The price is around 12.99. Another uh, feature of this uh, machine is all the parts is modular. You can see over there. Our machine for this year is like a monocular. So every part can be uh, removable. For example, the battery, if like after three uh, years the battery is dead, we will ship you a new battery. You can easily to replace battery by the by yourself. Like uh, five minutes, you can do it by yourself. Everything, like the motor, the well, the brush, everything is, you can do by yourself, DIY. So it's very easy to maintain. Hi everyone, this is Hopa Technology. We are from Taiwan. We are specializing in um, manufacturing and developing window cleaning robots. Our company starts from 2010. Here's a whole line of our product from 2012 toward today, 2024. Um, we are the first inventor of round model window cleaning robots. And not only the glass, but also the solar panel, this is what we can work on. 
any vertical flat surface is possible for our product to move. Um, and the square type, this is our uh, latest invention, just launched 2024. It has a dual reciprocate mopping feature all over the window. Um, and our product is applying the uh, suction power. So there is a vacuum motor inside to keep the robot stick on the window. This is um, typically what I have today. Thank you very much. So I hope that gave you a little bit of a glimmer into the things that you will find on the shelves in the next year or so that are going to help you keep your house, pool, windows, and solar panels clean. Now, if you like this kind of content, hit that subscribe button, give it a great big thumbs up, and let me know if you have any questions about what I saw here at CES. I'm happy to answer your questions down in the comments below.